Hi guys, it's Tamir from Lacquer Lockdown and today I have a holographic daughter care mini to share with you guys. Um, the products that I use will all be below in the box so I'm just starting off as usual with my Aunt Peel Off Base Coat and then I'm using uh, OPI's kind of navy's polish. I love this. It's called I Saw, You Saw, We Saw, Warsaw. Um, as the base and it is a little bit sheer so I end up having to go in for a second coat in order to kind of get it to opacity but I love this navy so much that it's worth it. This is Poss um, fast drying top coat which I love so much and then I'm going to use these cuticle guards to kind of get myself situated here so that I can protect my nails from all of the stamping that I'm going to be doing here in a second. You guys know I love these so much because they're latex free. They're so much easier than the um, old kind of um, homemade latex free peel off that I use and it's just quick. It's like quick and dirty so I love these so much. So I'm just tapping them down I'm using my awesome and well loved uh, KB Shimmer multi chrome tweezers to do this and here is the baby of the bunch super chick lacquer rum billy this is so gorgeous this is going to be my stamping polish for this this nail art and also for the first time i'm using my bliss kiss um kind of clear stamper and i don't know about other people i don't know if you've had an experience with these stampers but i freaking love these this has replaced every other kind of clear stamper that i have it's so awesome so i'm coming in with holy shapes um uh, kind of plate and i can't remember the number but it'll be in the box below rum billy and i'm just scraping everything off and then here's the bliss kiss stamper and i just stamp down what i love about the stamper it just conforms to my nails so perfectly it's so big i actually think something about the texture of the top too makes it stick more here's another super chick lacquer that's going to be sort of the counterpoint to rum billy i can't remember the name of this again everything will be in the box below though cleaned up the plate and now i'm just going to apply this as well to the plate you see these are so opaque because look at how easily that set and then I just pick this up and then I sort of slightly angle the stamper so that I'm sort of just letting that gold peak right underneath the the um, the red and they're sort of offset slightly I'm gonna use my Sally Hansen diamond flash because I do think this top coat makes hollows hollows look more holographic and yes so just clean up a little bit what's um, didn't get entirely caught from the latex free cuticle guard which you see they're so little and that's awesome and there it is this is so pretty so you can do it across all of your nails or not this ends up looking so attractive and I think it's because of the counterbalance of these two really beautiful holographic polishes this is Xyler the cat from Star Lily that I added as a little accent piece there and then I actually have one of the other super chick lacquer polishes on my pinky but this is so beautiful this was like literally one of those nail arts that I did that just kept sparkling and sparkling and sparkling and I think if you did all all five of your nails it would be a lot but I think something about this balance and just a little bit of it just makes it so perfect and pretty so I really hope you guys like this it's really quick nail art that just is somehow also really pretty um, please stay tuned I'm gonna have another nail art coming soon I know I always say that and then I disappear off but this time I mean it I have a lot of fun things in store thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe okay bye